So I had to make something that I love for one of the people that I love, right? I had to like make sure this was delicious. So one of my favorite drinks is obviously an ice pick. I've been drinking them forever. And why I love this drink is because there's no place you can go in the world that doesn't have iced tea and doesn't have a spirit. And all you're doing is putting these two things together anywhere that you go. I order ice picks pretty much everywhere. And I just got back from Italy um, this last um, spring and I had ice picks in the airport there. They had iced tea. It's just an easy way to guarantee that you're gonna get the cocktail you want. This one, however, is a little bit more complicated. So um, if you go to our tips in episode one, you will learn how to make um, an iced tea concentrate. This is a sweet tea, iced tea concentrate. So um, sweet tea, not meaning sugared. It is sweet orange, really beautiful aromatic. These are car car oranges, which I love. It's a type of navel orange. They just, they just hit differently. They smell good, they're delicious, they're my favorite, right? So what we're gonna do is we're going to start off with our alcohol. We're gonna use gin. Now, ice pick traditionally is made with vodka. You can make it with whatever you want, okay? I just, maybe like 99 bananas might not be good, but you know, I don't know. If you find the right tea, who knows? Yeah, it's like a... Just bananas. So we're gonna drop in here two ounces of um, Catoctin Creek uh, Watershed Gin. This is one of my favorite gins, local here in, um, from Virginia. Now we're gonna do our concentrate, right? We're gonna do four ounces of our tea per cocktail. And then we're gonna use um, a simple syrup, which is um, a tea simple syrup, but I made it with turmeric. And depending on how you like it, I'm only gonna put um, an ounce in each one. So this is a turmeric and um, a little bit of passion fruit. It's really quite lovely. Pour that in. Okay, so that's it, right? Crazy. Now you're gonna take your glass for a roll. So you'll take your um, your 16 ounce glass and you're just basically gonna go back and forth, right? And if you wanna get really fancy and longer, you can get longer with it. So all your flavor is already there. Now you can add at this point more, um, some people wanna use more Sugar, sure, if that's what you're feeling. The sorry, this ice is not as pretty as, um, it doesn't matter. They have like little thimbles, so they're, they're like getting the water in there, if you can see. Okay, anyway, so you're gonna put that in. We're gonna finish our drink with something a little bit different. A lot of times you'll use um, different fruit. Now you see these oranges, how beautiful is this? Right, so you have these gorgeous oranges and car cars are really quite amazing because they have this beautiful, like, almost like really, really sweet smell to it. And they're not like, they don't hit like other oranges. They just like have this like lovely um, aromatic. They use them like a lot of times in perfumes. Oops. Sometimes you want to, see when you want to get it perfect, you have to like really try for it. So we're gonna use that one. And we're kind of just gonna do that. It's such a pretty little drink. Thank you.